I'm like extremely excited. Saying goodbye is gonna be kind of hard. It's gonna be sad. Okay, we're going. We are hitting the final few hours before we go. I should be sleeping. Just kidding. We're good. Not Mom's kidding. You should be sleeping. <coughs> Shh. Mom's here to help me make sure oh, I have everything. You never fixed your pants. You know, it's fine. I'll just not bring them. I could probably go without some more clothes, so. Well, I can sew when you're gone, and then you can tell me if you need them, need them. True. Yes. It's like Christmas. More it's clothes. Like finding clothes all over the place. Shh. Whoop. <laughs> This is kind of weird. I'm like extremely excited, but you know, it's that initial just ripping the band-aid. We should seriously start counting the amount of times I say that. I don't know how else to explain it though, but it's this is my least favorite part, right? Like everyone hates packing up or unpacking. That's I feel like that's how you could best explain this moment right here is the packing everything up, right? Before you like take off or the accelerating, the bumpy, bumpy, and then you accelerate and it's good. That's what it is right now, it's just that. Saying goodbye is gonna be kinda hard, it's gonna be sad, but then I'll get going and it'll be good. And next thing I know, I'll be home. I mean, we have some friends, you guys know, remember the Nelsons. Their daughters have been on, like one of them has been on their mission nine months. Like she's already hit her halfway mark. That's insane. Like I'll hit my halfway mark, I'll come home before I even know it, so. I think it'll be good. I am so excited. This next chapter of my life is gonna be super fun, super cool, super great, but it's just the initial goodbye part that's hard. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. I have no idea what we're doing, except for that I'm getting dropped off at 1 p.m. That's all I know. I haven't been told anything. So I guess it's part of the surprise. We'll see what happens. So it is way past my bedtime. I have to go to bed. I gotta wake up early. I'm gonna miss my bed and my blanket and just being here and everything, but it'll be good. We'll let the journey begin. I will see you tomorrow. doing some chores right now. <laughs> Guarding the door. I think I've got everything. I hope. Maybe not. I don't know. I gotta go like right now. It's 6.53. I gotta go by 7 o'clock. Will we actually make it in the car and leave by 7 o'clock? Probably not. Because we haven't even left into the car, but it's gonna be good. shoes on got my stuff we're packing everything in the car we're heading out this is exciting it's like 47 who's ready she's ready i'm ready i actually really like my outfit today i think it's cute <laughs> So we still have a little bit of time. I can't wait to get some Thai food because I love Thai food a lot. We've all been in this car for a very long time, so I'm excited to eat. But I don't know if I will be able to eat because I'm so like nervous. So. like so nervous now because the MTC is like right down the street but I don't know if I have any um appetite in me oh my goodness I don't know how to feel I don't know why I'm like crying because I'm like super excited 
I'm nervous. I don't know. It's currently 12.30, so we're heading out soon. I'm so nervous, but this should be good. <laughs> Say goodbye. Like there's a bunch of missionaries. I feel kind of awkward. Great, I guess. and a half years. <laughs> 